Hi, how are you? Yeah. Yeah. Where's the corner section? Yeah, I love it. Yeah. <laughs> it's not cool rules for Miami. Is Miami a really hot place for dance right now? Miami is a hot place for dance right now. I feel that no one really knows the secret talent that's out there, but they should really watch out for it because we're coming full throttle. And is it partly because of the thing? I mean, it's all the Latino influence plus all the other influence. Yeah. What do you think causes it to be such a good dance place? I think um, the heat. I think the heat makes everyone want to dance and move. <laughs> Mia talked a little bit more today, this morning, about why she wasn't that big on you at first. And she said she didn't think you had as much work ethic at first in Las Vegas. Does that ring a bell? Do you think maybe at first was there something about it that she thought you weren't quite pushing as hard as you should have at first? I think maybe she, she did see that a little because um, when I went to Vegas, I wasn't really sure of myself. Uh -huh. I was like, I don't know if I can do this again. Because coming last year um, and having to do Vegas that time and coming back again this year, I was like, I don't know if I can take it again. I don't know. I don't know. But knowing that um, what she said really pushed me to prove her wrong. And I think that's what kicked it in the drive. So you ended up with a really good work ethic. Yes. yes. Oh, yeah. That, it really yeah. helped me. I could do nothing more but thank her. Yeah. Hey, when you got to that last item, number of the two show, Wednesday show, could you tell, hey, this is a really good item, this number, this could really help me? Oh, the pasta? Yeah. Oh, the pasta doble. Yeah. <laughs> that was my dance. <laughs> I think that we both just went out there and we were just going to give it our all. It was the last dance of the season and it was the last dance for us together. And I think that the 305 in Miami really brought it out. I think we brought the heat to LA. <laughs> what does 305 mean? Miami. It's this area code. Oh, I got you. Yeah. So you guys, here you are, did you ever dance together back in Miami? We have never danced together. Did you know each other at all? We did know each other a little. Yeah. Um, we um, knew each other through friends. Jeanette we, as well. Jeanette as well. And we all just really became really friends when we got on the show and I think we just connected even more just because we were from Miami. What would you say was the hardest and the best part of the So, at the studio. At the studio. So, um, being here, you really have to be even bigger and even more. And in the studio, there's only 300 people, and in the Kodak, there's 3,000 that are like way up there. So, you have to really exude even three times as much energy as you would in the studio, which is kind of hard, but um, with the audience there, it's easy to take. Congratulations. Thank you so Let's do one thing we forgot. So just give us one insight on Janine. What do you find interesting about her as a person? Where's the dance? Janine? The winner, yeah. Oh. Let's see. Interesting about Janine. Or unusual about her. Because you work with her a lot, yeah. Janine's really goofy. Okay. And she loves to fall. She loves to fall? Yes. She's constantly falling. In rehearsals, she falls a lot. <laughs> can we tell her? Can we say she? Uh, you said that to her? Said yes. that about her? Okay. Yeah. She loves to fall. Yeah, that thing where you throw yourself to death. Oh, that looks hard. Does it, does it, do you always get it right? Not if I always get it right. I have to be very careful. I think that's why my wrist is hurting a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> but um, it's it's fun. I like to push limits and I like to do things that no one has done. And I like to defy gravity because I think that I'm a witch and I can float. <laughs> so are, are your moves like Brandon Bryant uh, creations or are they actual like classical moves? No, my moves are my creations. I really just push the envelope. I'm like, how can I get off the floor without using my hands? I kick up my feet and use my back. <laughs> I really just try to push the envelope to things that people have never done before and no one ever seen. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.